What's up everybody? It's Jake back in the Barbin Garage Gym and for today's video I've got my good friend Chelsea Bourgeois with me on a call because we're gonna be talking about the best tasting protein powders on the market in 2024. Now we all have different taste buds, we all have different preferences. Taste is obviously a subjective thing but we have spent a whole lot of time testing, researching, whatever you want to call it with a ton of different protein powders on the market and we've came up with what we believe to be the best overall options so first of all chelsea thank you for joining me today how you feeling oh thanks for having me i'm excited <laughs> well we love having you and before we really get going with this video there's two questions i want to ask you the first one being does it matter when you you know ingest your protein shakes or really protein in general and then the other one is why is protein so important that's a great question protein is really important for a lot of different reasons it plays a role obviously in muscle building and you know helping us reach our fitness goals, but it's also involved in our bone health, hormone production, so much more. So, you know, so many biological systems rely on protein, and of course, you know, we're getting that from our diet. Um, as far as the timing of your protein shakes, as from a dietitian's perspective, I just want you to meet your protein needs. So you find what works best for you. There's really no set best time to take your protein shake. Back in the day, they said it was so many minutes after your workout, but you know, as long as you're getting it in during the day and really spacing out your protein intake, to me, that's um, ideal. All right, well, Chelsea, thank you so much for all that helpful information. Now, we got a whole lot to talk about today. It's gonna be a decently long video. So let's go ahead and tell everybody at home what our favorite option is on the market. None other than X-Works Grow. This is a 100% grass-fed whey isolate from New Zealand. So for those that don't know, New Zealand is very strict on their guidelines. So you're getting a very high quality product here. There's 25 grams of protein per serving. You're getting, let me double check on this. There is 110 calories per serving as well right here. Chelsea, what really stands out to you with X-Works Grow. Yeah, so like you said, New Zealand is really strict with their guidelines, especially for their livestock. So they have strict rules about the hormones, antibiotics, and pesticides that they use. So you know that that's not going to be a factor in the protein that you're taking through you know, X-Works Grow. Um, the calories are low because they've really prioritized the protein content. So there's not a whole lot of carbs, not a whole lot of fat. Um, so the bulk of what you're paying for, the bulk of what you're ingesting is going to be protein to help you know, boost your protein intake uh, throughout the day. That's a, that's a very good point that's worth noting. So this is the chocolate flavor right here. We're you know, really fond of it, but there's three other flavors as well. So definitely go and check that out. Our best overall tasting option on the market is X-Works Grow. Now, before I continue and go on and on about the other products we're gonna talk about today, just wanna make sure y'all know that we do have an article that pairs with this video. I definitely recommend you go and check it out. All you gotta do is search Barbin, best tasting protein powders, and that's it. It's gonna pull right up for you. Now let's keep going. Now, vanilla protein powder is probably the most popular out there, honestly, most popular flavor. So for us, our favorite vanilla protein comes from Transparent Labs with their 100% grass-fed whey isolate. Now, don't have it on hand, it's because we flew through the tub, right? So I, uh, once, something I really think is cool here is they have 13 different flavors to choose from, but they have three different vanilla flavor options. I think that's really cool. There's also no artificial coloring, sweeteners, or preservatives here with this protein. Chelsea, first of all, what are your thoughts of whey isolates overall? And then what really stands out to you here with Transparent Labs? Yeah, so whey isolates I think are great for those that are really looking for a lean protein powder. Um, we've got two different types of whey. You get whey concentrate um, and whey isolate. Whey isolates are going to undergo more processing, so more of the carbs, lactose, fat has been removed during production. Um, so you're not getting as many calories, and like I said, you're getting a more concentrated protein source. Um, so for those that don't want to skew their other macros or they want to keep their calorie count low, the whey isolate is a great op uh, option for that. Um, I think what stands out to me might be that sugar cookie flavor. It sounds so delicious. <laughs> I've only tried the vanilla flavors, but I haven't, um, I haven't tried the sugar cookie. I think that'll be next on my list. And then I think also too, it's great. Transparent Labs is true to their name. They are transparent. They have their products third party tested and everything is written right there on the label. Yeah, I, like I said, I flew through the vanilla, the regular vanilla flavor option. And then, yeah, I love how transparent they really are, you know, as the name you know, aptly suggests. And another, another really cool thing here I, I like about this product is that it is third party tested. So if you're somebody who needs that, cares about that, whatever, 
I think that's a really good option for you as well. So there it is, y'all. The best vanilla option on the market comes from Transparent Labs. Okay, so we just talked about the best vanilla option on the market. So let's talk about chocolate now. For us, this comes from Optimum Nutrition, where they have eight, that's right, count them, eight different chocolate options for you to choose from. Now, one call out right here is that this is a protein blend with whey protein isolate, concentrate, and a hydrolyzed whey protein. So definitely something to remember right there. Another big, big benefit, in my opinion, with Optimum Nutrition is how easy it is to get your hands on it. Plus, it's really affordable, and you can purchase a 10-pound tub. That way, you're stocked up for a really long time. Chelsea, what are your major call-outs here with Optimum Nutrition? Yeah, I first of all, I love that there's so many chocolate options. That Rocky Road, oh my gosh. <laughs> Um, I, you know, I think it's a great protein option. Like you said, it's affordable. You won't get bored because you have so many flavors to choose from. Um, one thing I will note is it's got some um, artificial sweeteners, which I'm a very realistic dietitian, so you really won't catch me hating on artificial sweeteners, especially when they're consumed, you know, in moderation. Um, just keep an eye on your digestive tract. Make sure that you're tolerating it okay, because sometimes those artificial sweeteners can disrupt the gut microbiome. But um, if you're eating a well-balanced diet outside of that protein shake, to me, I think this could be a great addition. Yeah, and you're getting 24 grams of protein per serving here, 120 calories. Now, one thing I do wanna, wanna mention is I've personally tested a lot of protein powders. And whenever I was shaking this one up the other day, it was a little bit chunky. Now, I don't know if that it could be operator error, you know, for me not shaking it up enough use a blender that probably will eliminate that problem that's just something that you need to keep in mind so there it is y'all best chocolate protein powder on the market comes from optimum nutrition okay so we've talked about a lot of whey products here i think you know what time it is we're going to transition to our best plant protein on the market best tasting and that comes from ritual okay with their 18 and up protein right so 115 calories per serving right here. Another big call out I have is it's kind of expensive. So this is a 15 serving container. It's gonna cost you about 40 bucks. So you're flirting with around $3 per serving, roughly around there. But something I think is really cool here, well, two things. Every ingredient here is made traceable. You can go to their website, click on it, all the way back to the direct source. I think that's really nice. Another thing here, which is pretty rare with pea proteins in general, is the inclusion of 400 milligrams of methionine. That is really, you know, really unique because it, it creates a complete amino acid profile. So Chelsea, I want to get your thoughts, you know, overall, why do you think this is targeted towards 18 and up? And then also, how do you feel about pea proteins in general? Yeah. So Ritual, I think, does a really good job of separating their protein powders uh, and gearing it towards a certain demographic. So we have the 18 and up, which is geared to, towards adults 18 and up. But then they've also got that 50, 50 and up and then pregnancy and postpartum. So we know, you know you're getting a, what is recommended at those, uh, at those age groups. Um, so this 18 and up is really geared towards adults looking to increase their protein intake. I think they've done a really good job. I love that that um, methionine is in there. That's an essential amino acid. So that means our bodies can't produce it. We have to get it from our diet. So it is a more expensive protein powder um, when you look at that cost per serving, but you're getting a lot of bang for your buck as far as those, that amino acid profile goes. Um, and then pea protein, I'm a fan of it. You know, it is a specific taste, so it might be something that some people have to get used to. I think Ritual does a good job of, of meshing it with vanilla, um, but it's uh, got a pretty creamy texture. It's usually very easy to digest, and of course it's vegan friendly for our plant-based friends. A lot of good stuff right there. And, and yeah, pea protein definitely has a you know very specific taste, and you gotta, I guess acquire it, you know, get used to it. Another thing here is that this is only available in vanilla. So if you're not a vanilla person, you know, it might not be the best option for you. But our opinion, it's the best tasting plant-based protein on the market. All right, well, that's a wrap on today's video over what we believe to be the best tasting protein powders on the market. First of all, Chelsea, thank you so much for joining me today. Thanks for having me. I'm really glad to be here and I'm about to go um, buy me some new protein powders with these new flavors. <laughs> There's a lot of good options here on this list and I don't know if you guys noticed or not, but we weren't able to cover every single option on our list. So that's why I think you should go and check out our detailed article. Remember, all you got to do is search Barbin Best Tasting Proteins. It's going to pull right up for you. And you can go over all of our top picks. 
You can learn more into why each product won its specific award. We'll catch y'all next time.